even though Diddy also has definitely a lot of sauce on this stage, it's a little hard to beat what Pikachu brings to the table here in terms of lightning loop, in terms of up air bridges, in terms of just the really impressive combo extensions that this character can get, as well as just Teagle, which we're seeing him really throw out early. Yeah. Sorry, I'm like trying to make sure that I know who is who, just so I don't get confused. Mm -hmm. But no, this is awesome. I like the cute little Pikachu outfit. And Yeah, um, Pikachu Libre coming out. She is a monster. Or, or makes it happen. The quick attack just to try and punish the landing, but EJJ is ready for it. Tranko really has not been able to find a single combo opener here now. Our uh, planking on 60 off straight hits means that you're out of Pikachu's low percent, and you're not quite at that kill confirm range yet. Uh, there's definitely still things you can find here. You can find, you know, an up air bridge for sure. You can find up airs into, you, you know, a double back air, maybe a drag down fair into a re grab, but you're just. EJJ does done such a good job maintaining center stage. Now Trango's gonna have an opportunity and gonna find an F smash. Is not gonna close it out, but the low recovery gonna go unpunished. Trango getting a little bit nervous. Didn't want to quite commit, and EJJ is yeah. gonna punish him now, putting him off stage in the reversal. But this Pikachu we're talking about, this character is very difficult to edge guard. Oh, I heard Pikachu's a really good. Uh what do you call him? A good. He, that he's a really good. Uh good character. Yeah. Yeah. Pikachu is one of those characters that people have kind of talked about since the game's launch is maybe being the best in the game, and that confirmed Whoa. drag down Nair, confirming into down smash, gonna close it out. Trango just playing it patient, finding the opportunity when it was given to him, but now Banana gonna confirm into the grab up air, not gonna do it yet. FD Blast Zone gonna come in clutch for Trango. Oh, and same with that back air, just a little too far away from ledge for EJJ to close it out. But he's doing a really good job at not letting Tranko tack on this extra percent. Though Tranko is slowly clawing away stage control. Oh, finding an opportunity for an up air bridge, but just doesn't confirm it. Looking for an up, an F smash and is gonna lose his stock for it. But after putting on 60%, you can't be too unhappy with that if you're Tranko. Yep, and this is what we were talking about last game, right? You see Diddy book putting on so much damage, he just kind of gets in your face, yeah. smothers you, and he's just put on 86% on answer. 99, now that's a crazy amount of damage from off one neutral win. Trenko there just not able to find the Nair he looked for, and the up throw back air, unfortunate DIN yeah. from Trenko. Oh, and just like that, EJJ pulls off a nearly perfect stock there to find the lead. Yeah. And then both of them are doing this without their coaches, so they're doing, I mean, they're doing great. I mean, it's yeah. awesome. And remember, not everyone has a coach at the Arcadian, right? You aren't required Ooh. to. I, I pretty much didn't for all intents and purposes. Um, did but you, you had a coach? I did not. Oh, you did not have a yep. coach. Yep, maybe, maybe that's part of why I went O2. But <laughs> who cares? Because guess what? I'm here on the mic now, and that's what matters. This is my <laughs> home. This is where I like to be. Exactly. And you know who else likes to be? E here, these two players. Oh yeah. There's as Trenko now doing exactly what EJJ did earlier, doing a really good job of slowing the pace of game oh. down. Gonna find that dash attack at Damn. calling out EJJ and getting a little too antsy holding forward. He did jump, but he didn't get away fast enough. Gonna lose his stock. And now making great use of the banana as well. There's an up air bridge. <gasps> That's gonna be the game, but it sends no. the ball away. And EJJ no getting another opportunity. Oh. He, if Trango had just input that thunder with Drift, it would have spiked. Or if it had sent the other way, that would have been the game. But instead, Ed, Trango has a, Trango is seeing his life flash before his eyes. Can he close he, it out here? No, he really did. That's insane. He's really fighting for his life right now. Yep, both both players are, oh but EJJ, gosh. right, taking that opportunity and making the most of it. Oh, and yeah. He's bringing this one all the way back. Just like that, Trango's got to start looking at, at the percents, being a little worried about his own stock. Yeah. Uh, EJJ's just capitalized on every single neutral win so, so much that he just won't go down. No, he won't. Damn, no, he's in there. Oh! Yeah. He got him. He got him. That was crazy. Boys, <laughs> we got him. Boys, we got him. <laughs> but kicks down door. Oh yeah, that's how <laughs> go down. That was good. That was insane. I like Pikachu. I feel like Pikachu's really cute and adorable. And then I see a lot of what is it, Diddy Kong? Yes. 
I see a lot of Diddy Kong here. I feel like that's all I've really seen. A lot of players really pick him as yeah, the main. Yeah, a lot of a lot of people like Diddy in general. He's a very fun character. He's very fast. He's got very creative combo roots. He's got a lot of movement. He's got good a banana. Fra good frame data. <laughs> exactly. He's got banana, which is broken. Um, a broken banana. Exactly. And also, Tweak, the best Diddy Kong player in the world, and Tri-State local, wow. just won a major tournament last weekend. So a lot of people might also be picking up this character. Yes, yes, yes. That being said, I don't think EJJ is one of those. I think he's been playing this character longer just based on the fact that, you know, the way he's converting off these openings, he definitely seems very familiar. And okay. going back to FD, interesting choice from EJJ, but the way the last game went, I understand it. And uh, not to detract from the game, but I think someone left their controller here. Oh, that's Gabe's. Here, I'm going to give this to you because that should not be under a pillow. You don't want to <laughs> let a couple I hundred swear. dollar controller like that get damaged. It's, no, this is it's, American flag one. I feel like I know this. Yep, and the quick attack on the landing going to lead into a little combo here from Drango trying to call out the double jump drift in with Thunder, but not going to find it. However, EJJ is still going to be caught in the corner trying to find his way back to stage. But Trango's playing this game so much more patient than he played game one, uh -huh. and it's really paying off. He's really getting a lot more off these ledge situations. I agree, yeah. I feel like they're taking it a little bit easier. Not too quick, and good use of banana. And again, <laughs> right there he is calling out those double jumps and those landings from EJJ with the dash attack. That's how he's really been finding his most of his kills so far in this set. Yeah. Not gonna find one there, but gonna rack on damage. And now both these players are scrapping in neutral. But again, it's gonna be Tranko finding the hit, putting yeah. EJJ in the corner. And yeah. he keeps trying to throw him off, but mm -hmm. now, look, now he's on. I feel like he was keeping, he was doing a good job keeping him off until now. <laughs> yep, Ooh. but again, right, this is what EJJ has done so well is turn a bad situation into a good one, find yeah. some percent. And oh. the barrels is gonna do it, but <gasps> EJJ getting sent off stage wow. too far down, didn't have a jump and yeah. unable to come back. Yeah. So Tranko's gonna get away with that one. But after he looked like he had it sealed up, he still tacked up. He still took another 60%. So this game is far from a runaway by any means. EJJ needs to find a stock did so right as I was saying that yes. and just like that uh, we are right back to an even game. Right back in even game. Damn. Okay. Alright. Who has more of a benefit in this map? On this stage? Yes. Uh Pikachu. Pikachu has the more. But the space from the, the Diddy Kong has to really abuse his movement and the fact that banana and flip get kind of get unimpeded by platforms. It does reduce your landing mix-ups, but what it does do is also mean that you can be a lot more precise with your banana throws. You don't have to worry about yeah. about things like a platform getting a in the way of it, for example, game. right? Yes. But it's, it is definitely Pikachu, and the drag down back air is going to show no. you exactly why confirming off the banana, and that's Diddy's recovery, right? Yeah. He didn't have a jump, so he just, again, wasn't able to get back to stage. DJ looks like he's stressing out a little bit over there. That being said, right, he immediately found the banana, right, allowed him to close the gap, find an F smash, and brings it right back to even again. Trango trying to get a little cheeky with an up air bridge <laughs> into a narrow air into a narrow loop starter there, but not gonna find it. And now Ooh. just trying to stick a back air together, could have found a second one, but opting instead of a dash oh. attack. Now he's gonna again have the corner situation, but the grab there almost could have done it, but it's Pikachu we're talking about. This yeah. character can get back from the depths of hell, and that certainly <laughs> wasn't those. I love that. Oh, no way. I agree, definitely. It reminds me of, like, Sora's the way Sora and he, the way he, like, steps around. That's what it reminds me of. They have a really good recovery. Yep. No, exactly. It's, it's actually, I would even argue, better than Sora's recovery. It's a lot more flexible. It goes a further distance. Um, you know, that's an up B versus Sora's being a side B. The air dodge off stage. Gonna allow him to get away from the situation. Almost looked like disaster and could have been if EJJ had chased him, but opting not to because that would have been either one of them would have died. And now Trango having the opportunity, oh, he just wow. keeping him back in the ledge, trying to reset the situation. But great barrel root from EJJ to really find good. his way back. That was so good. Damn, the weak hit so dash attack though is gonna give EJJ a third lease on oh. life. Trango keeps calling out, but just now able to close Damn. it out. He. Woo. Really good win from Trenko, but going forward in bracket, he has got to clean some of those up, right? We saw him drop kill opportunity.